Last Christmas, I gave you my heart, but the very next day, you gave it away. We gave it away. This year, so save me from tears and give it to someone special. special. What's going on, everyone? We're back with another video for you guys. Yes, today is episode, video one of two that we're yep. uploading today. Mm -hmm. The first one we're doing today is the new map on Murder Mystery 2, yes. Log Cabin. I'm so hyped, dude. I know. It's actually such an amazing map, and we are going to do a full map tour of it mm -hmm. and show you guys every single secret hiding spot on the map so you guys when you're playing murder mystery you guys know what to do and know where to hide because exactly. it's gonna be pretty because useful. you want to hide from the murder when you're collecting these snowflake tokens you don't exactly. want to die exactly that's very true and you want to win the rounds and there's a lot of secret stuff that we want to show you let's just get straight into it you guys are gonna love this let's go so we're in the front yard area oh so this is tour plus hiding spots yeah right? it's like a two in one uh, okay, we're gonna do okay. a tour of the full map and show you guys all the hiding spots along the way yeah so we'll show the outside first so you can see a nice gate here yes with the fallen tree with yep. the snow flying out Oh, pretty cool. Right. I like that. I, I like, like that touch. What else is cool out here? So we got some front porch chairs. chairs. Yeah, yeah. got the chairs. wreath on the door. Yeah, I like how there's a view of like someone having hot chocolate in the window. Right. And I like how this window is open. I know we pointed it out yes. earlier. Yes. But it's like another entry exit way. Yes. So I think I'll go through the front. So there's like four ways. You can yeah. go through the basement. You yes. can go through the window, yep. through the door, or through the side entrance. So from Where the front, there's four ways. Let's go the normal way Let's for now. Normal. Okay. And when you're in here, this is like the main... Uh, Lobby, yeah, it's or? like a kind of like the um, right before the living room type, yeah. Vibes. It's you got like a little books. library, yeah. Yep. You can't hide in them though, right? No, but you can hide in these dresses. Yes, these are gonna be main hiding spots. Yeah, and you can look out them actually. Too. That is very nice. That you, when you're in it, you can see if yep. the murderer is coming. Or exactly. If you have the gun, you can jump, jump out and shoot. You don't even have to jump out. Oh, the bullets shoot. are going straight through. Yeah, exactly. So you can go into oh. all of these four. All four. Little, yep. Okay, all so all four are good hiding spots. That's awesome. Okay, so wait, wait. Can you go in there and put hold your gun out and see so if it does it? Out. Yeah, does it stick out? So that's why. So when you're in there, you can your gun is oh. out, which allows you to shoot, which is cool though. So just pull it out when you know you're about to hit the murder and yeah, like last shooting. second. Yeah, exactly. Okay. So let's move on, and now we're going into like the main dining area, living room area. Oh, so this is the open window. Yeah, that's where you have the flow where someone's chasing you. You're not stuck in a dead end. Oh, that's cool. This is really nice room. Okay, I like this. Yeah, it's just a little dining room. No, no, not too many hiding spots mm -hmm. there. More of a just run around. But here's one. Yeah. The fridge. The fridge and the kitchen connected to the dining room. You can okay. hide it. It's actually a pretty big spot probably two people could actually go in yeah, there yeah you could even put more there's a lot of uh, maybe even more there. yeah this is a pretty big spot right? uh, no you can't go in the sink Sadly, this year you can't go in the sink yeah so what from the kitchen you got the that you got the pathway to the basement yep which we won't go just yet we have the washroom and then we have the living room so in the washroom there's no really hiding spots i don't yeah. think can't really hide anywhere here but it's a i nice mean if you could go against the wall maybe or something like that i was like, thinking you could like jump on this ledge but i don't think you can yeah you're kind of just stuck. Yeah. It is a little spot that you could run into just for a quick juke or something, but other True. than that, not really a good spot. Oh, and there's of course the hot cocoa, which is very nice yep, being made, that. or a coffee, whatever you drink. <laughs> uh, so I guess we could go into the living room. Yep, so, so here. This is a beautiful area. Right. I love it. There's a few hiding spots here. There are a few hiding spots here. Let's start with the start? tree. Let's start with the tree. tree? So yeah. this tree is a nice hiding spot, especially if you have the um, Zen emote. Oh, you gotta yes. You got to have the Zen emote to hide your feet. Oh, so you float straight into the exactly. tree. Wow, that is actually really good. You got to like really hug it, put on some small godlies or knives, whatever yeah. have you, especially the ghost knife. And you have to kind of like shimmy. I think in the front is like the best the spot. best spot. Yeah, right there. So you're, well, not dude, you're literally out. hidden. It's yeah, actually really so you good. Can turn off effects. And Boom. things like that. So I have small godlies. It yep. will work a lot better. And also, you could probably, if you don't have Zen, you could probably sit or just go behind the tree. Yeah, exactly. It's not as good, obviously, but you could definitely squeeze yourself back there and hide as well. But behind the tree is... Zenning is so good. Look at that. Wow. You can't even see. You're literally hidden. No one will literally notice you. Let's zoom in. Now, <laughs> we can't wait to do some videos and actually troll on this map and see right? if we can win some rounds like this. It's going to be so funny. So, also in this room, beside the tree, actually. Mm -hmm. The big gift. Yep. You can go behind the big red present that you yep. see in the living room yeah this could fit you and your friends this is just like workshop yeah um also comment down below if you guys want us to do an updated workshop hiding spot that mm. was from last year so True. we could do an updated video but we wanted to do the new map of course which is this present the, a lot of these were in workshop as well yeah very similar yeah so now we can go across there's more hot cocoa yep. a lot of presents. hot cocos everywhere presents some stockings and we get to the 
the fireplace. Now, this year, you can't go in the fireplace. You could zen like you're doing. Yeah, but I don't think you hide too well. Yeah, it doesn't work the best. Uh, I don't know. I don't think you can't fall from up there. It's no, blocked off. I wish so, there was a ledge just like workshop. That yeah. That would have been cool. It would have been interesting. But for now, you can at least go in there and kind of hide on the sides. But that's, Oh, that's true. Yeah, something like that, maybe. Hide your arm a little bit. Yeah, it still works a little bit. It's not the worst spot. Yeah, and if they're coming from that hallway over there. Yeah, they won't see you. So mm -hmm. you can use like it for like a quick one second hiding spot. Mm -hmm. uh, I guess we should go finish off outside, yeah, right? Just, okay. This is the one of the four entrances. Yeah, so that's the side entrance. It leads to the front by using that pathway. Mm -hmm. You could hide in the jacuzzi Dude, like you're a doing. mini avatar. I swear. You're definitely sw underwater. Just, like, yeah, go full underwater. Yeah. Hopefully they don't spot you. Yeah, so this this takes you straight back to the front. You can't hop over the railing. Yeah. Uh, it's just a straight uh, a pathway that way. Uh, and then I think that's it, right? So if you go back over there to the jacuzzi, was it the same thing? It's I just, believe so. So there's just a jacuzzi spot. Mm -hmm. And there's some Chairs, a little hot cup. This one outside is a glass cup, which is interesting. Every right? every other cup in the map is very interesting. Is, is is white, and that one is a glass cup. But there's no other hiding spots. You can glitch out. Yep. It looks like you can go out there, but you can't. It's yeah, all sealed it's off. It's all blocked. Now moving inside. Yep. You go back inside. Turn around. I saw a nice window. That's a nice window. Oh, that is a nice window. The very high ceiling. Yeah, I really love the high ceiling vibe. Right. Very okay, pretty. I guess now our next move is to go upstairs. Yes, and here there are a couple hiding spots. Yeah. Oh, okay, so there, you can go out It's a long full hallway. flow. It's yeah. another another uh, circle that you can go around. Right. So this is a guest room, I believe. Well, guest washroom. Oh, bathroom. We got Mr. Santa Ducky. Yeah, oh, that's really cool. I like that little ducky. You can't really hide that well. You could probably hide maybe behind this door, kind of. It's a little bit hard if yeah. someone oh, goes this walks around. Well. Oh, that's a pretty good spot. If you can even fit, probably more mini avatar spots in here. Yeah, definitely mini avatar spots, but we didn't want to do it, like show you guys only mini avatar spots because yeah. obviously not, not everyone has them. Exactly. Uh, but I think you could go behind that bed there. Yep, so this is like the little guest bedroom possibly. Yeah, like really good spot right here. This is a sneaky sit. one. Oh yeah, right behind the bed. I love this spot actually because it's right in like the this angle. Yeah, roof, it seals you ceiling. off, so they can't see you from that side. They have yeah. to only go around. Probably one or two people could fit in this spot. It's actually a pretty good yeah, spot. Nice spot. I like that. How I cute. think that's, no, that's it in this room, yeah, right? This, you can maybe oh, get behind that chair a little possibly. bit. Yeah, a little hiding if spot. Not paying too much attention. Yeah, it's not the best spot, but it could definitely work. It yeah. still counts. You can look out that window as well. I really love looking Very out the window. Pretty. Very nice vibes, snow flowing. Okay, so from this room, it takes you back into the main hallway. Yes, yep, that door works as a spot as well. Oh, yeah. I think it could. You're right, you're right. Yeah, right here. That's a nice spot. That's actually a good one. I don't yeah. think people would notice this spot. They would no, uh, not suspect this one. And it's like a spot that is easy to get into. You can actually just slide into it without yeah. stressing out. The murder is running after you. Yeah, exactly. You slide back Whoop. here. Just slide right in. Okay, so that's another one right nice there. Spot. And then, can you go on top of the door? Nothing over there. Yeah, yeah nothing over here. Okay, yeah. so then moving into the next room uh, which is the master bedroom and yes you can access this from the long hallway yeah so that's the full thing around right yep. there and obviously you can jump over the railing and just make a mad dash for it out of there mm -hmm. so this is the master bedroom what spots do we have so in here first we got the door of course another door spot mm -hmm. another very door nice spot. one it actually works very easy to hide back there yep i think that's it in like this area but yeah wait could you go behind that little that there like in oh, that corner oh wait a minute joven you can go behind here yes as dude well. another behind the bed hiding spot it makes it look like you can because like of these yeah because of the effect ceiling. yes so you can Whoa. actually hide in here with a few of your a friends lot of people yeah. yeah two or three people and then maybe even over here yes. as an added spot as well mm -hmm. so but, there's a decent amount of spots here yeah but there is a really good spot which is up here yes the secret attic spot you, you can, can just climb, climb up here and you're just a single spot right yeah just one i think i think maybe a few people two. can go uh -huh. uh, but there's no, nowhere else you can go guys it's just like a little tiny uh individual like one little attic area there it doesn't go anywhere else i like this spot this one's really clever. yeah i like it a lot a lot of people already love going to this spot it's one of those spots that everyone just like loves to go to yeah uh, so you get you better be careful the murderer might find you there uh but it's definitely a cool spot this thing really looks like you can't hide behind it yeah that's a really good spot there behind that one really? all right so let's go to the balcony mm -hmm. which is not really any main hiding spots yeah, but you could open. use it to get out like run away exactly you can go on those poles there yeah, I believe so. That's pretty cool. Do you think I can get on the roof? It's probably blocked Could off. you? Yeah, you'll probably get bounced right off. Oh, yeah, yeah I got blocked off. But now that we fell, we can show you guys. So that's a good way to just run out of the room so you yeah. don't go back in and die. Exactly. But now that you fell, you can show them the shortcut on how to get up, not using the staircase, guys. Yes, especially if the murderer is there. You don't yeah. want to go on the staircase. You, you could use this lap. light. Boom. You juke him. Yeah, so don't forget to use that light because that's like, I think he literally put it there on purpose. Yeah, it's a nice shortcut. 
to go yeah. upstairs instead of that's why this staircase. whole map is just this amazing like flow i love it and then so i guess we could go to the basement from outside so mm -hmm. we showed you guys how to get inside from here and then now we can go through the basement so there's that window as well you can hide on that side of the basement Wait, door yes you can yeah. this is a really good spot to yeah hide. i like this spot a lot you can mm -hmm. hide right here. here yeah right there the murderer won't even think about checking Wait, yeah. they'll just go right through to the basement under, and you can hide right there the uh the flap yeah the flap right here yeah so that's oh, another good, good spot, spot as well. Yep, definitely it helps with the cinema. Uh, so this is a shortcut to the basement. And the basement has a <laughs> lot of spots. It's bountiful of spots here. Yeah, so you can pretty much hide behind every single box, of yep, course. Exactly. Room. This is the first basement room. So it's like the so you come from outside, yep. you go into here. This room, does this room have any spots? Yeah, just one spot. I guess it's kind of a spot. Yeah, it counts. Yeah, it still behind counts. some boxes. And yep. then over here, over here, you could hide around here. Yep. Uh, okay, so then after the first basement room, you go to the second one. Yep, it continues into this bigger box room that links to the upstairs yeah so that's Over straight there. to upstairs so this is this is what you're talking about there's this little crevice yeah you cut and then you, you can, can go, go into here. here you can even go up to here or it's probably Ooh. better here yeah actually. below definitely below oh yeah. that's such a good spot you just really hide down here yeah wow that's actually sweet so then this is like he actually intended for this little cutaway exactly. to actually go into like a secret area fence. Okay, cool. And then this flows straight. Can you go behind? That's actually not bad if you could glitch try it. Try hard enough. Yeah, you could try to get even just right here. That's That's actually it. not too oh, bad. It kind of glitches you out. A little bit of a glitch avatar. We can make yeah. things happen. Yeah, guys, here. stay tuned. We have an awesome mini avatar video coming out yeah. for you guys, uh, especially with all these new spots. So when you exit that basement room, this area, you mm -hmm. go into like the actual basement of the house. Exactly. There's a TV. You can lounge. Couple chairs. You can probably hide behind those yep. chairs. Hide behind this bench boop, with you boop. and your buddies. Yep, that's an awesome it's a spot. Big bench. Yeah. yeah, you can fit a lot there, and you will not be seen. Nope. TV. There's no sit spot above the TV. I don't no, there think. Isn't I think it's right. It's, it's ah. super flat. Ah, that'd be too too tight. Yeah. Yeah, that tight. won't fit. Uh, right those here. boxes, I don't think that'll work either. Maybe if you're a smaller character, possibly. Potentially mini avatar spot. Yep. But that's pretty much it in the basement. And then you just take the staircase right up, which leads yep. you back to the kitchen, like we said before. And that's pretty much everything. Yeah. We've done the full tour, all the spots. I love this and it, map, dude. Yeah, it's an amazing map. So cool. What do you guys think is better, this one or the workshop map? Oh, that's a tough choice. I love the vibe of the log cabin. I love the flow. Had a lot of, yeah, the flow is better, flow but workshop had more secrets. Nice. True, it did have more secrets. Like, yeah. Push like the presents like yeah, that think, trap door yeah alrighty guys that is the full tour full awesome, hiding spot dude. videos and if there's anything else we'll let you guys know uh, from playing but we don't think there'll be anything else I think that's pretty much everything yep such uh, a cool map dude with the background of the amazing. mountains amazing guys let so us know what pretty. you think about the map and what do you guys think about all the hiding spots in the comment section we'll see you guys in tomorrow's video actually you'll see us later today because we upload two videos today yep, we're double uploading guys yes every day until Sunday and including Sunday there will be double uploads on the yep. JD channel so Stay tuned, turn on post notifications, leave a like, and start go JD, buy some merch. Thank you guys so much for the support. Yep, we appreciate it. Happy Merry Christmas Eve. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Hope you guys have good vibes. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye from me. Adios. Peace.